Hey guys, my name is Ryan, and today we're gonna to be going over a little bit of a chacha routine here uh, that I made, and we're gonna go through a variation of steps and timings that we use in cha 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 on the daily. Okay, so during this time, what I want you guys to remember is to make sure that you keep your feet compact. The reason why is we're gonna be going through a lot of steps that are pretty quick. And what I wanna avoid is really trying to you know, make a big step, then it takes a lot longer to get that weight transfer going. So if we keep our feet underneath our body, everything's gonna be a lot quicker. So we're gonna go over the very first step starting off. We're gonna start with a forward check. So the forward check is just basically this. We're gonna go step forward on the right, left, back onto the right. All that it is. So when I'm gonna put into my counts, I'm gonna go cha, cha, one, two, three. We're gonna show it from the back. Music's playing two, three. We're gonna step cha, cha, one, two, three. Excellent. Following that check, we're gonna do what's called a slip chasse. So we're going into our check, one, two, three. And all that's gonna happen is a slight rock back. Cha, cha, one. One more time. We're gonna go, one, two, three, cha, cha, one. If we blend it all together, one, two, three, cha-cha, one. Awesome. Now again, just remember to keep your feet compact. If you guys really fully commit every single step, good luck making it to music. Honestly, I wouldn't bet my money on you guys. What we're gonna do is we're gonna keep those feet compact. Tiny, microscopic steps is what I wanna see to make this work, all right? All right guys, so we just did the forward check and the slip chasse, so now we're gonna go into a back basic, okay? And this is just honestly what I like to say, a little bit of a rock step, kind of to change the direction that we're going into. So if we blend the whole three steps together, what it's gonna look like is we have our forward check, so we're gonna go one, two, three. We have our slip chasse, so it's just a cha, cha, one. Notice how on that slip chasse I didn't fully transfer back, right? I just did cha, cha, one, switch. And then we're gonna do the back basic with the right leg. We're gonna go back all the way, forward all the way. Awesome. One more time, we're gonna do it all the way throughout. So, one, check, slip chasse, Back basic. I'm gonna do it from the side for you guys. We're gonna do a forward check starting with the right leg, forward with the left, rock back, tap, step, switch. Transfer back, rock forward. Excellent. Following these three steps, we have what's called a hip twist chasse. Now, this might get a little challenging, so again, I'm gonna revert back to that initial tip that I told you guys, keeping everything compact. So if I do my back basic, finish that back basic here, I'm going into the hip twist chasse. What I have is a cha-cha one. So I basically cross my right leg over after finishing the rock. I cross over, step onto the leg, put my feet together, and push off to the side. How's that gonna look from the back? We're gonna go two, three on that back basic. We're gonna cross our right leg over our left, step, 
together side. A little bit faster. Two, three. Cha, cha, one. Now, if you guys notice, I'm barely moving. So it's not that I'm going two, three, cha, cha, one. I'm not doing that. I will never make that music. I would never make those beats. So I'm literally keeping it just next to my other foot. You see how I'm like keeping it super close, super tight. That's what I want to see you guys do when executing the steps. So what we're going to do right now is going to, we're going to blend all those steps that we did from the very top. I'm just going to show you face on what it's supposed to look like, okay? So I go forward, one, do the check, two, three, slip chasse, back, basic, hip, twist, chasse. From the back, we're going to go, one, check, three, Cha cha slip chasse, switch the leg. Back basic two, three, hip twist chasse. Great job, you guys. I'm gonna do it a little bit faster now, okay? We're gonna try that specific section together. Here we go, guys. One, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one, two, three. Cha cha one. Gonna show it from the side. We have one, two, three. Cha cha one, two, three. Cha cha one, two, three. Gave you a sneak peek into the next step. All right, cool. Awesome, guys. Great job. Now we're gonna bounce straight into the next step. You guys already know it, we already did it. The very first one, it's this forward check. So the forward check, honestly, what I use it a lot for, well, what everybody really uses it for is for a change of direction. It really helps kind of uh, divert and uh, create a little bit more variety here. Otherwise, we keep doing the same thing over and over again. Very boring. So we have our uh, hip twist chasse. I go into the check to take myself back. And then we're gonna go into a back lock. So how's that gonna look facing on, right? So I finished my hip twist chasse, cha cha one. Did my forward check, two, three. Now we're gonna go into the back lock. So it's gonna be a cha cha one. How do we do this back lock? Great question, guys. So after doing the check, two, three, all I'm doing is I'm putting the ball of my foot, I'm planting it down onto the floor, sliding my front foot to the back, so then it creates that lock right here, and then I'm pushing off the front leg onto my back leg. That's the execution of the lock step. So one more time, I'm doing a forward check, rocking back, planting my foot, sliding and pushing off. If I do it full out, It'll be this, two, three, cha, cha, one. Great, I'm gonna show it from the back. We're going from the hip twist, we just finished it here, forward check, two, three, plant, slide, push off. One more time, finish the hip twist chasse, we're going two and three, Plant and push. Great job, guys. Let's do it all together. Blend the whole thing. I'm gonna face around. We're gonna start from the very top. Here we go. Starting with the forward check, we're gonna go one, two, three. Slip chasse. Cha, cha, switch. Back basic. Two, three. Hip twist chasse. Cha, cha, one. Forward check, two, three, back lock, cha, cha, one. A little bit faster, guys, here we go. Forward check, one, two, three, slip twist, cha, cha, one. Back, basic, hip twist, chasse, forward check, back lock step. To count, here we go, ready, and one, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one, two, three, cha cha one. 
Great job, you guys. Now we're gonna continue on. So we just did a back lock. I wanna go back to where I started from. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna change our direction by doing a back basic just like we did in the beginning and doing the same thing forward. So it's a forward lock, right? How do we execute this? So the, initially this is what it's gonna look like. We have our forward check, we have our back lock, we have a back basic into a forward lock. Pretty simple. Doing it from the side for you guys just so you can clearly see my footwork here. So I did the forward check, going into the back lock, going into the back basic, going into the forward lock. All right. Now, how are we going to blend this whole thing? So, after we finished our back lock step, cha cha one, your weight should be fully on the left leg, right? So it's this one right here. Right leg, supposed to be free, weightless. Now, we're gonna take that right leg, we're gonna transfer back, rock forward. So now again, your weight has to be on that left leg fully. Right leg should be free, weightless. What we're gonna do is we're gonna step forward on that right, boom, lock back. So it's just a basic cross, kind of bring in that leg, knee behind the knee, and then we're gonna push off that leg forward, boom which will create that lock step, okay? One more time, so we finished our back lock. One, rock back. Two, rock forward. Three, transfer forward onto the right. Cha, slide the left foot behind. Cha, push off the left foot. One, and then back into a check. Two, three. Great, we're gonna do it one more time from the side. We're gonna do the check back lock, back basic forward lock. So that's that combination, okay? One, forward, check, cha a cha a one, two, three, cha cha one, two, three. Great job, guys. What I'd like to do now is do the whole thing to my count, and then we're gonna try it to music. All right, here we go, guys. Starting from the very top, check, and one, two, three, slip chasse, two, three, hip twist chasse, two, three, back lock step, back, basic forward lock step, two, three. One more time, now it's just the counts, here we go. One, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three. Awesome, let's go to music. Two, three, cha, one, two, three, cha, 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 cha, one, two, three. All right, guys, one more time. Here we go. Two, three, cha, one, two, three, cha, 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 cha, one, two, three. Solid. Good job, guys. So we just finished our forward lock step. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna repeat that slip chasse. We have, we're very familiar with that step from the very beginning of our routine. And then we're gonna transition into what's called a time step, okay? So what does that look like? We just finished our forward lock. So we did our cha-cha one. We we're checking forward two, three, slip chasse. Now, if you notice, this time we're not gonna be putting our feet together. What we're gonna do is two, three, cha, cha, one to the side. How is that gonna look like from behind? Two, three, cha, cha, one. One more time. Two, three, cha, cha, one. Great. 
Now, if we do it from the lock step, what does that look like? So we have our two, three, lock step back, two, three, lock step forward, check forward, two, three, slip chasse. I feel like that was pretty clear, right? We're gonna go into the time step now, and the time step is probably one of the easiest steps that you can do, one of the most basic steps out here in cha-cha-cha. This will allow us to kind of catch our breath, have a little bit of a rest, and uh, get ready for the following step. So we did our slip chasse. We're here, we're gonna go into the time step. The time step is just basically marching in place. We're gonna go two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one. One more time, from the back. So one more time, we did the forward lock, cha, cha, one, check, three, slip, cha, say to the side. Now the time step, we march, march, cha, ah, say, march, march, cha, ah, say. One more time, march, march, cha, ah, say. Great. What I'd like to do is I'd like to go from the very top to music and blend everything in. All right, here we go. Two, three, cha, one, two, three, cha, one, two, three, cha, 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 cha, one. Great job, guys. Great job. Okay, so time step. I feel like that's probably one of the easiest steps in this routine. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to make a little bit of a change here with the time step. So we did three basic time steps. And what we're going to go into now is a syncopated time step. So the steps don't really differ that much. It's really the speed or should I say the frequency of the steps that change now. So after finishing the last one, we did two, three, cha, cha, one. We're going to go two and three. So it's going to be two and three. Continuing into the next one, cha, cha, one. Two and three, cha, cha, one. Best way to look at it is you're marching in place, stepping to the side. March in place, step to the side. March in place, step to the side. Ba, ba, da. Ba, ba, da. Ba, ba, da. Yeah? How does it differ from the basic? So in the basic, what we do is we do a whole beat on each march. So we go two, three, cha, cha, one. Two, three, cha, cha, one. On the syncopated, what we do is we actually hit that triple on the two, three. So we go... One, two, and three. Cha, cha, one. Two, and three. Cha, cha, one. Pretty clear? Yeah? So let's do this. We're going to just do the basic time step and the syncopated time step. Okay? I'm going to count it with you guys and I'm going to call it out how many we're doing. So we finished the slip chasse. We did cha, cha, one. Full weight on the left leg. Right leg's free. And we're going to start marching. So we're going to march two, three. Sha a say, march, march. That's two cha a say, march, march. This is our third one. Sha a say. We're going into the syncopated, so it's going to be march, march, step, march, march, step. So we're going to go march, march, step, march, march, step, march, march, step, and march, march, step. Perfect. So. All in all, three basic time steps and four syncopated time steps. Cool? So what I'm going to do is we're going to just do the time steps to music just so you guys can see what the difference looks like. I'm going to face the camera first and then I'm going to turn around for you guys so you can follow. turn around for you guys and we're gonna do it one more time to music here we go 
So full weight on the left. March, march, sha a se. March, march, sha a se. Syncopated. Da da ga, da ga ga, da ga ga, da da da. Great job, guys. Great job. Awesome. So, we're already coming into the end of the routine. What I'd like to do is we're gonna take all the steps that we learned today, we're gonna blend them in together and uh, see what the result is, okay? Here we go. I'm gonna count it out for you guys and I'm gonna call out the steps as well. All right, starting with the forward check, stepping on the right foot, here we go. We're gonna go one, two, three. Slip chasse, back, basic, hip twist chasse. Forward, check, lock, step, back. Back, replace, forward, lock. Now we're gonna go into the slip again, to the side, basic time step, cha-cha-cha. Basic time step, cha-cha-cha. Basic time step, cha-cha-cha, into the syncopated. Two and three, cha-cha, one, two and three, Cha-cha, one, and what's gonna happen here? We're gonna go back into the check and start all over again. Two, three, cha-cha, one. Pretty good, pretty chill, hopefully. Let's try some music. Two, three, cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha cha one two three cha cha one two three cha cha one two three cha one two a three a cha one two a three cha one two three cha 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 one two three cha cha one two and three cha cha one two three cha one okay guys so that was our little cha cha routine there this is honestly if you guys can keep going and going and going on repeat it's great for your cardio you're gonna be losing your breath i can guarantee that um, what I want you guys to remember is to make sure that you're keeping those steps compact. Again, there's no reason for you guys to extend or run from place to place. You can honestly pretty much mark the step. Even if you're not going full out, what I'd like you guys to do as an exercise, mark the steps. So if you have like, so it's two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one, two, three, cha-cha, one. This is gonna help just understand where you have to be generally, and it's gonna encourage you guys to take those small steps, okay? Thanks so much for joining us today, guys. So my name is Ryan, and today we did our cha-cha routine. If you like this content, please like and subscribe, and leave a comment as to what your favorite step was. All right, catch you next time.